Hey guys, it's Anna and Vito here. What up? And we are, you know, talking about something really important today. For those of you that have courses or products online and you're looking to get your message out there and help more people with what you've created, but it can be frustrating when you're not selling, you know, when that offer yeah, isn't when you converting. Put the offer on, don't convert. Uh, I've been there. And so, what's the biggest, so, you know, what's the biggest advice you give to people, V? Well, if you've got courses or offers out there that aren't converting, it's all coming down to your marketing. Yeah. But marketing can be such a big topic. It can be there's so many variables and things you can look at there. Right. But we always like to kind of coach our students that you got to look at the big four before you go start trying to like look at even smaller things. Number one. Were you clear on the audience that you were speaking to or that you wanted? Because one of the big things is people try to talk to everybody and then the message gets lost in the white noise out there and they didn't just nail it down to like, this is the specificity of whom we're trying to talk to. So then the message gets whitewashed and lost out there. Yeah, amen to that. And I think that a lot of times we also forget the second point, which is we're not talking directly to the problems that people are pains. having in the pains. We're always talking about our thing. Like, you know, what we're selling. It's not really it's what we have, it's, not the, it's not the stuff. But that's what we're always thinking about is actually about what is that stuff gonna solve for that's right. others? Because people in the market looking for solutions to their freaking problems and their pains and you gotta ultimately understand that in, as your business. But from there, the thing is, is because of that, everybody kinda like tries to soften their promise. And then because the outcome is not strong and clear, they don't nail it. So you wanna get clear on the outcome that you deliver to people because people are out there trying to buy the outcome. Yeah. Like we deal with people that are trying to build an online business. So the outcome that they want is I want an online business built. That simple, that clear. Like <laughs> when I look back at the end of the day, did I build an online business? Yes, no, if not, what do we do? Right, exactly. I mean, it's just like, uh, I mean, there's a great, great example out in the market right now of Weight Watchers. Weight Watchers mm. decided to change their branding from Weight Watchers to WW, like anybody knows what WWFing means and whatnot. Decades of building their brand around Weight Watchers mm. and they completely changed their message. But then instead of saying their outcome used to be, and I might be slightly bastardizing this here, but their outcome used to be like, lose 10 pounds in 30 days guaranteed. That's a clear outcome. Right. They made it feel happier, be healthier, and that's just really soft and wishy-washy. It's like land the plane. What does Correct. that actually mean in my life? What does that give me back? Right. You know? And because a person can then look at your program and be like, did it deliver what you promised? That's gonna freaking make your marketing pop. And then lastly, yeah. were you clear on the transformation that you promised? Mm -hmm. A person wants to transform from the life that they're in or where they're at to where they're going. So how do you do that when you're out there? Like for us, like when we're talking to our, our students, our ideal customer prospect, we're really like, they want the freedom lifestyle. They want to stop living in the job world or yeah. in the brick and mortar world. They want to be at home parentpreneurs and they want more freedom, whether it's time, financial, location, purpose, and people freedom, whatever it is. They want more of that in their life. So like the online business, the outcome of building it is getting you out of that and transforming your life to living your ideal dream experience and imagine waking up every day the way you want, working your business where you want, how you want, when you want, with who you want. You know what though? I can also see that when you miss the outcome, then the transformation, the transformation just yeah. sounds like wishy-washy, like sure, of course I can have the freedom lifestyle and work from where I want, when I want, but when the outcome is mm -hmm. you will build a six-figure online business that's tangible. That's something that you can see and visualize for yourself. That then you can see, oh, then I would be able to have that freedom lifestyle. Right. So you can't miss solving the problem, knowing the audience, making sure that you're nailing the outcome and the transformation. That's it. And I had to learn this marketing jargon as I went, but you guys need to know that now is the time to really get serious about understanding your marketing message. That's it. I mean, if you're trying to make your office convert, you're gonna have to start knowing your marketing and whatnot. It takes time, it takes practice. The whole point is you just gotta get in the game and start going that. So Do look it. at the big four, and I think you're gonna find your offers converting better out there. Hey, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, consider hitting the like button below. And if you wanna know how to go and build an online coaching brand that can do half a million dollars plus with under 100 people so you don't have to live on social media, we created a free training that you can access just by hitting the link in the description below.